The short animated video will illustrate the major steps involved in fabrication and rubber lining of a carbon steel pipe. A fabrication drawing is developed using information provided by the customer, typically an isometric drawing. The completed drawing is sent to the customer for their review and approval. The pipe is constructed following the specifications designated on the approved fabrication drawing. The fabrication will follow all applicable industry standards. The completed fabrication is checked against the drawing for conformity and all required non-destructive tests are performed. The surfaces to be lined are blasted to a white metal surface with a 2.5 mil profile. The blasted surfaces are coated with an adhesive system specified by the rubber manufacturer. This typically is Chemlock 289, 290, and 286 adhesives. A tube is formed from the specified rubber compound. The edges that form the seam are skived to make it leak proof. The tube seam is stitched to make sure it's closed tightly and to promote cross linking. The stitch tube is then inserted into the pipe. The flange faces are applied, completing the lining process. The lined pipe is cured in an autoclave. The outside of the pipe is blasted for paint. The outside of the pipe is painted with a customer approved system. A final inspection is performed to ensure that the pipe conforms to all of the customer's specifications. If you found this video useful, please visit us at www.proco-fwi.com.